A lot of folks believe gongs were invented so that prog rock or metal drummers would have something to hit in order to emphasize the weighty seriousness of what they're up to. One visit, though, to New London's Lyman Allen Art Museum and a current exhibition called Encountering Resonance, Aaron Taylor Kuffner's Gamelatron, will broaden your horizons and soothe your soul. As it turns out, as Kuffner knows, gongs appeared thousands of years before T-Rex sang about banging one pursuant to getting it on. Their place in Eastern culture is both sacred and aesthetic, particularly through the tradition of gamelan, an Indonesian musical tradition indigenous to Java and Bali that utilizes various sized bronze and iron gongs and percussion instruments struck by mallets to create a mesmeric, percussive, and lovely form of music. Gamelan so fascinated Kuffner, a Brooklyn-based conceptual artist and sculptor, that he spent years in the East learning everything from how the instruments are made and crafted to the distinctive modalities and tunings required to compose and perform the music. Back in his Brooklyn studio, Kuffner fused East and West, the ancient and the postmodern, with what he calls Gamelatron. It's a sound-producing kinetic sculpture, several of them in fact, at each site-designated installation that fuses the classic gongs with mechanical and automated mallets. When activated by a computer, the mallets strike the gongs and instruments and perform Kuffner's own digital compositions. With three or four gongs or more complex installations in any given chamber of the exhibit, an amalgam of separate rhythms and melodies continually sound. Rather, though, than a cacophony or headache-inducing quality, the music is seductive, therapeutic, with a cumulative meditative effect one might associate with bird song or wind chimes. To progress from room to room in encountering resonance is to not only marvel over Kuffner's ingenuity, but to appreciate his applied vision to a marvelous age-old tradition. Plus, as the visitor quickly learns, the experience is interactive so that each guest can create his or her own musical experience intuitively by choosing where to sit or stand and absorb the particular sounds of that space. One might leave encountering resonance surprised to learn that a great deal of time has passed since you walked in maybe thousands of years. Encountering Residence is on display at the Lyman Allen through May 23rd.